With the season-ending injury to running back J.K. Dobbins, the Ravens have a big question to answer about how they plan to offset that loss. Now, the first answer to that question is that the Ravens feel like they have the options in-house. At this point, John Harbaugh said the Ravens do not feel like they need to look elsewhere through a trade or the free agent market to add another running back to this team. They like the pieces they have here with Gus Edwards and Justice Hill, and they also plan to bring Melvin Gordon up from the practice squad. Now, we've seen what Gus Edwards can do through the years as a lead running back. He can handle that workload. But I really think that Justice Hill is going to turn out to be a vital piece of this offense, and I think he's up to that challenge. He scored a pair of touchdowns on Sunday after J.K. went down, and I think that is a sign of things to come for Justice. Remember, the Ravens re-signed him to a two-year contract this offseason. They wanted to keep him here in Baltimore. He has good speed, and he can catch out of the backfield, which is a real asset in this Todd Munkin offense. I think the Ravens will feature Justice in the passing game, but he also showed on Sunday that he can thrive around the goal line. He's more than just a change of pace, third down scat back. He has a good nose for the end zone. Justice is also another year removed from his own torn Achilles, and he looks really good right now. The Ravens are confident in him and his ability, and Coach Harbaugh talked about that yesterday. The way he's played speaks for itself, right? I mean, you guys have seen him play. The fans have all seen him play now through the years, but also in the preseason and yesterday. So I don't think it needs any explanation. He's got tremendous confidence in Justice Hill. He's, he's a very good running back. He's a very good all-around player, and uh, it's going to be a great opportunity for him. Now, with all this said, I still think it's going to be a committee approach to some extent. Gus the Bus is a really good back, and he also showed that on Sunday. So he's going to get his touches in this offense. And there's no doubt that it's tough to lose J.K., but the Ravens are confident in this backfield, and they have good reason to feel that way. Now, that's it for me. But before I go, I also want to make sure you saw that we announced our events that are coming up ahead of our London game in Week 6. It is going to be a busy week across the pond in London, so make sure you get all the info on that by visiting BaltimoreRavens.com London. Thanks for watching. I'll see you again tomorrow.